Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play the Hardcore Minecraft Let's Play. Pretty sure that was some kind of horrible monster. So there is no sadness in actually, well, doing what we did. Because, if memory serves, that was a witch. I have no idea how a witch was able to spawn that far into the depths. But had I have done something horrible with that witch, like, let it do stuff, it probably would have fired loads and loads of potions at me. <laughs> this time, though, that did not happen. But we have a fair amount of stuff. It... I'm getting paranoid that I'm hearing noises of things shooting at me. And I'm not, I doubt. Doubt I am, anyway. So let's finish off this little mining run and head back to the surface for now. We got some cool things. There's a few little areas I wish to keep exploring. Like down here, for instance. I got too close to comfort for death. Like, seriously too close. You saw how low my health got there. You saw how low it got. Half a heart. If I'd have been hit by one more zombie, that would probably have been the end of it. So you've already been here before. <laughs> Yeah, I remember getting lost here quite a bit, so, um... Let's not go that way. I don't want to get lost in these dungeons. So... Let's head the way I've been, which I'm pretty sure is this way. Yep, this is looking all familiar. And... up. This is, I think, where I nearly died. No, I think I nearly died a little elsewhere. Nah. Nearly died here. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, not something you really want to go. And this is where I nearly perished. That was close. If I'd have been hit one more time, it would have been curtains for the Avatar. I feel like exploring a little down here before we go on. Oh, a little waterfall. And an area with a, with a monster. Ow! Ow! Okay, more of them. They're giving me a good supply of arrows, at least. No, oh, it's just a tiny little alcove with nothing in it. However, well, there's something up there. Yes, there is. Riding my way up a waterfall. To where, I'm not quite sure yet. Okay. Ooh, iron. There we go. works. Two iron. For my troubles. Oh, I've lost my helmet. The helmet's finally broken. Most of my armor's breaking, to be truthful. I should really think about crafting a new set. And I think this leads back to the exit. Yep, this is looking pretty exit-like. Uh, how much iron did I make? 52. That's probably enough for a whole new set of armor. I can still hear that uh, slime. 
the time being, however, I'm going to leave the slime. You can really hear them there, can't you? Leave the slime be. And this is when it, something shoots me. I catapult but <laughs> No. I was about to say, this is when something shoots me, and I catapult spectacularly into the lava. The game nearly did that. It nearly did that. <laughs> nearly, however, is not good enough. Which is good. It was trying to. It really was. But no dice. Yeah, it should be daytime by the time I get back up to the surface. We can do some smelting and all sorts of fun stuff. Ah, it's normal zombies. Nothing cool about normal zombies. There's a chance when a zombie spawns that it will be a villager zombie, but at that point I was completely unable to save them anyway. Oh dear. I, I need to uh, deposit some st need to deposit some stuff. Else, oh, that guy died. Else, I'm not going to be able to recover all of this. He must have died over there. You see that one of them uh, last video dropped an iron bar. There is your infinite source of iron. The fact that zombies can drop iron bars. Hmm. 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 Okay. How's the cocoa doing? Oh look, the cocoa beans are actually ready to harvest. That's not bad. We'll harvest those cocoa beans after we've uh, started up the oh, 24 iron bars in there already. After we've started up the forge. Get three more loaves of bread. That'll help that. And I uh, suppose we'll hold on to that. We have an eye of Ender that we've been just been keeping in my inventory for a while. Is there anything else I particularly want to keep? Well, all this stuff's kind of useful. Not the sticks. The sticks aren't useful. Gunpowder. I think I have some. A pile of gum. Yeah, there's several piles of gunpowder. Really needed to organize that a bit better. Hmm. And I'm going to need a lot of coal to make that into iron ore. Seven gold ingots. That's always worth going down into the depths for. And craft that, and that, give that, to that, do this, and get a lot of torches, because I need torches. And we'll leave that going. Probably gonna need a new um, chest at some point. I do have an egg. Chicken? No. However, they are hatching more eggs. No chickens. Oh. That's unfortunate. Oh. 
That's probably from one of the very rare um, zombie riding chickens. Anyway, well, ah yes, I was going to uh, get some cocoa beans. That block is not meant to be there. Some sort of enderman moved that. And then you just plant more cocoa beans. What's that? Ah, oh, it's a squid. I thought for a moment that was a legendary sea cow. But no, no sea cow. Okay. Oh, I have a spare pair of boots. That's always good. And I have a helmet. And some leggings. And a spare chest plate. So that's a whole new set of that arm made. Sort of essential that I did that. I think I might have been in some bother without uh, replacements. Hmm. There we go. And one more for my trouble. Still no diamond, though. Although going down into the depth searching specifically for diamond could potentially be a complete um, effort in futility. When you're searching very specifically for diamond, you don't tend to get very far. I should probably dump the remnants of my uh, armor in this chest so that if I need to repair my armor, I have something to repair it with. For the time being, I think it's time to be decked out in some new armor. And by new, I mean exactly the same, but not damaged. That armor lasted me a very long time. A very long time. And we'll get some more paper. Which will make some more... Oh wait, do we actually have any... Uh... We have four. That's good. Can make another bookshelf, I think. And this is sort of the reason why we're doing this, but... So many bookshelves do we have now? Three. It's not bad. Oh, don't throw that away. We need that. Okay, and 64 of that. Oh, we have loads of this. We're gonna need some more chests. We need to build one here or something just to store cobblestone. You always end up doing that. You always end up making a chest for, like, here is the chest for the really mundane stuff. Like, this here is the cobblestone chest now. I'm just gonna get all of my cobblestone and just dump it in this chest. Might not be efficient? No. But it's gonna save me a lot of space. Cobblestone and stone. There you are. I can also put all this nether rack in here as well while we're here. Suddenly, I think I'm going to find I'm going to have a lot more inventory space. If I actually organize my inventory, like this, I'm going to take up half as much room. You end up just having chests for everything in Minecraft. You have a chest for that, a chest for this, and before you know it, you have chests all over the place. That's gravel don't necessarily want a gravel chest. And it's raining, which unfortunately means this bit likes to leak rain. Does it have to leak rain? It's actually a good question. I'm not sure it does. It doesn't. That's better. I just think I don't want to get wet as I travel from one room to another. 
Well, it's not just raining. Oh, it's a pig man. Hey, Bert! Bert's back, people! Yeah, where have you been, Bert? Hmm. Been hiding? Went on holiday, did you? Well, welcome back. As you can see, a lot of things have changed since you've last been here, Bert. A lot of things have changed. I'm gonna turn around and he's gonna go again, aren't I? Let's... Where has he gone? There you are. Would you like the guided tour, Bert? Or do you not actually care for the guided tour? I don't think you care for the guided tour. You're just hanging around, aren't you? Examining the, uh... What the island is, but look, there's a house. I could put you in a house, Bert. I, you don't seem interested in that. You just want to walk in my food. That's fine. I'll just dump some stuff away and... You can have fun looking at all the food I've accumulated. I think I might breed another cow. Seems like a smart plan. Breeding another cow. Shoo. Like that. And that. For another book. And we'll quickly breed another cow. Bert's still here. Yeah, he's just having fun in the sea. He came here for a swim, didn't he? One and two. Have another cow. Yep. What is Bert up to? <laughs> so long, Avatar, I'm off. To go on an adventure in the sea. I don't want to go out there. Um, I'm just saying it's uh, not entirely safe. I don't need this. Just throw that away. Oh, nine arrows, though. Oh, look at how much more clear my inventory, my uh, chest is now. Oh, I have another bow. I can fix this bow with that bow. Make a slightly less broken bow. Excellent. Start there, but good. I have forgiven your past transgressions against me by running away, by the fact that you returned. This is a good thing. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Look at all those cows. So when we come back, folks, Bert has returned, and that's pretty much it. But we did get loads of cool stuff, and I did sort my inventory out slightly. And it's raining. That's always a thing. So I'll catch you later, folks. Wait, wait, wait. There you are. See you later, folks.